John here. In this lesson, I'm going to go through that lick you just heard. It's um, lick in B minor pentatonic. We actually have the Dorian note as well. Uh, so the natural sixth of the key, but other than that, it's purely uh, B minor pentatonic. So we only play this one in the beginning. Anyway, if you want time for this one, you have uh, all the details in the description down below. So check that out if you need it. Otherwise, uh, just follow along here. I'm going to be pretty quick though, because you can get the tabs if you want to. So, like I said, we're in B minor, start here with a sweep, going up 14, 17, 16, 14, 15, 14, 16, that's the, the Dorian note again, and up to 17. So, and the way that I pick it is down, hammer, down, 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 up, down. So I actually get a seven note group here. Uh, from there, we're gonna use this old Frosty uh, Yngwie sequence. And if we number the notes from left to right, one, two, three, we get three, one, two, three, two, one. Uh, so I do that twice, I believe. And then I extend it to the pentatonic instead. So I'm gonna play the root here, 19. So same thing, just I'm, um, Exactly the same uh, pattern, so still the three, one, two, three, two, one. I'm just changing the, the notes. So. so after that, we move up to the 22nd fret and we play 22, 19, 17. And then we have a key Marcello sequence on the next string. If you're not familiar with that, it's a five note sequence. And uh, number of notes from left to right, one, two, three. We got two, one, three, two, one. And Put them together. Move down to the next available note on the same string, 17, uh, 15th fret. And now a very easy sequence. One, two, three, two, one. Again, a five note sequence. And then the next string, we have uh, the key Marcello sequence again. So, And that's basically how we're gonna continue on the lick until we get to the end. So shift down to the next available set of notes the one, two, three, two, one sequence. And then the key Marcello sequence. Shift down. Easy sequence. And then the key Marcello sequence. And then we do the key Marcello sequence again. And then down to the root note. So might sound very confusing, but like I said, you have the tabs available if you feel that you need them. All right, from the descending run again. Oh, that's basically it. As far as practicing this, I would work on the initial sweep into the alternate picking first. So you get used to that. And then make sure you have this the six note sequence down as well. And it's a very similar feel, even though you're, you're just stretching out your fingers here. Uh, and then you can try to loop this. This one is hard to loop, but you can do this. and go through it like that. So just connect each section. Uh, but if you just take it easy, focus on accuracy, and then the speed will come with time. And it can take a long time sometimes. Uh, so don't be discouraged if you feel like you've been doing this for you know, weeks and, and you still feel like you're not Paul Gilbert yet. Paul Gilbert wasn't Paul Gilbert either within a few weeks. So it will take a lot of good reps to get the technique down. But once you got it, uh, it should be fairly dependable and solid. So just keep at it, focus on the accuracy. And if you have any questions, just post them below. Otherwise, see you in the next lesson.